Yeah! Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, the idiots. I'm Corbin. I just want to know, are we going to see his underwear on Rick? I would assume so. I would hope uh, so. And you can follow us on Instagram and, and Twitter. Twitter. Oh, juicy content. It's Rick, if you're so watching, juicy. we're not perverted weirdos. Well, yeah, we are. I just want yeah, your underwear. Yeah, he wants your underwear. <laughs> uh, but uh, thank you for subscribing to Patreon. Follow us on official Twitter account. Also follow us on official 2.0 channel. Bang! But today, this dropped uh, this morning, I believe, on Rithik's um, Instagram. Really? Uh, well, I haven't been on Instagram today, so I wouldn't have noticed it because I follow Rithik. They dropped uh, his HRX, which is the uh, his company that does his underwear, uh, his transformation from Super 30 to War. Oh, this is going to be great because... Right. Uh, yeah, he was, first of all, it's so funny, every sequence of that film, you know that just before cameras were rolling off camera, they're just like getting as freaking <laughs> jumped and jacked as you could, your arms don't look like that resting. Yeah. They and just don't. So we've seen one other transformation. But yeah, he got, oh, particularly he got his arms, his oh. biceps got freaking. That dude's massive. Massive. That's the biggest Rithic's ever been. Um, but we've seen one other transformation, the Amir Khan one. Yeah, he, for Dongo. Who was really fat. So. And Super 30, Rick, it was, Rithik wasn't unfit. <laughs> no, but, I don't think that man can be. Yeah, I don't think he can be, but he really did. He was definitely much, much smaller than, uh, yeah. than uh, he was in war because, man, he was jacked in war. He was fully... And here's what I'm interested to see. We won't know this unless he really talks about it. I hope everything about his training is clean. I really, I really hope it's so. clean. I would, he seems like the type of guy. He that, does... His he his arms got big enough that my I was thinking to myself, dude, I want to know what kind of protein supplementation you're using, and if you're using any kind of human growth hormone because that he was freaking that almost dude. bodybuilder big. His biceps, the dude's jacked. He was really big. Let's check it and, out and very very lean. I want to know what his diet was because he was crazy. Hopefully lean. they go into it. Let's see. Here we go. But I'm going to go. Maybe it's too heavy for now. I'm going to do something else. Hey, wow. I didn't realize he was that out of shape. He still looked really good in Super 30. Inside the area. Super 30.
first of all, on just a personal inspiration note, I'm, I'm about to, um, in my working out schedule, and I know a lot of you have asked me on Instagram and other stuff to post things about my health regimen and what I do, which I, I intend to be doing. Uh, I, I've been in an in-between phase because for a while, for about five years, I was needing to maintain a particular physique for Barbarian yeah. to play primarily Peter and Regulus, which is a one-person play that I do, and I play multiple characters, but it's these main guys. And Peter is this bulky fisherman, and Regulus is a actually a gladiator. So I was maintaining a certain weight level and a certain muscularity that since I haven't been portraying them recently, I haven't needed to carry that, but I like to. Mm -hmm. So I literally, for the past few days, I've been getting myself ready to gear up for the next, like I wanna go on a three or four month phase of getting back into great shape. Mm -hmm. I'm not unhappy with the shape I'm in. Whatever this 30 day transformation is. Yeah, I, I, this was just an Instagram video, so right. it's not like the other one with Amir um, Khan. They, they made it for the YouTube and they got to go right. to more detail. And I've done, I've done workouts, like uh, the, the I would love to know 300, the, the actors for 300, they had a training video. And so I've, I have implemented some of the 300 stuff before when uh, the, uh, Henry Cavill had to play Superman and Man of Steel there was a transformation video for the trainers that, and I implemented a lot of his training sometimes and I love to intersperse. I want to know what the freak you do, dude. Yeah. And release, I it, release a YouTube video of talking please. about what you ate. Like, I want everything. to know everything. Like I, maybe this was, I'm hoping this was just a, like a, a promotional or it's, it's called an inspiration. No, I can guarantee he probably the 30 days, nobody else can do because I, I, my bet is for 30 days, this is all he did. Oh yeah. And I, he probably did, he guaranteed he did two a days, maybe three a days. Yeah. And he <laughs> had every single thing he ate and drank oh, yeah. scrutinized for 30 days. Uh, yeah. and if that was all done pure with a natural supplementation of nothing but say, uh, protein powders and creatine and branched chain amino acids, and you didn't use any human growth hormone or anything else like that, dude, I want to, we've got to know what that was. Yeah. Yeah, really. that transformation is insane for thirty days. Man. Yeah, because like I didn't know he was that out of shape for Super Being Thirty. He, he didn't look that bad. I know he looked smaller, but he didn't look that bad. No, he didn't at like, all. I, and, and knowing what physical fitness and means did he do that on purpose or did uh, I'm sure I would assume right because oh, Ricky doesn't sure. seem like the guy that would just. No. Let himself go, It's right? the same thing we noticed him being a bad dancer in the film. He oh, was yeah. trying to portray the dude. Mm -hmm. yeah, even he had to portray the guys, you know, he got flack for it. That The guy's got darker skin than he does, so mm -hmm. he really wanted to do authenticity to portraying the guy. Yeah. Which, it's not going to happen, because, Rithik, you're considered one of the most beautiful men to ever exist. That's so, true. that poor guy, there's no comparison. But, <laughs> uh, and the other thing, I can totally relate said he had a couple of slip discs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you do. Yeah, yeah. I have I have one. I, I, uh, if I could get surgery to fix it next year, that'd be really awesome because it's, it's been a 20-year-plus thing, and when it goes out, it's... If it happens again, I'll... Well, anyway, hopefully it never will. <laughs> it's, 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 it is brutally bad. Yeah. Uh, and he, too, would have to do what I do. Yeah. My workouts, everything I do in the gym, in my mind, I'm like, careful of the back, careful of the back. There's some leg exercises I cannot do. Because it, my lower back gets compromised. Ab stuff, I have a weird thing. Back problems happen because of ab, your abs being weak. But I've had a hernia in my abs since I was seven years old that I've never had to need corrective surgery for. Mm. But I've always had to be careful of it when I do ab work because I don't want to aggravate it to the point I have to go have a surgery for it. Yeah. So I want to know what the freak. Yeah. I want to know everything. Diet. I'm, Regimen. Hope, I'm hoping he releases a, a longer video of like what he actually ate, like yep. uh, how many times it. Because yeah. this was this was just like an like his uh, defeat defeat video. It was kind of yeah. just like almost just sporadic. You see you see him. Yeah, here it's, a, and it's an advertisement him. for what I hope yeah. is his video that'll tell us what he did. Yeah, I would love to know. Love that. to know that. I mean, he he was freaking jacked. Which, by the way, little uh, just public statement: don't adopt anybody's workout routine until you know what you're doing and maybe need to, especially if you don't have, if you've not worked out before, do not try to replicate Rithik's routine. This is a professional athlete. The don't guy's a dancer. This guy is I, with I, I personal trainers. Same body. So <laughs> don't just pick up, like I told you that I picked up the 300 and, and Henry Cavill's workout routines. I've been working out and lifting weights and doing stuff physically since I'm 15 years old. So you need to consult a doctor, make sure you're healthy enough to do it. There you go. Public also, service announcement. Don't try to pick up my drinking routine if you haven't been drinking. You're not gonna be able to do it. It's I've been drinking since I was fifteen. Uh <laughs>
thought you started way younger than that. <laughs> I did. I was being I honest. Was it, wasn't, it, wasn't it in the bottle? <laughs> yeah. You know, they you put, some Jameson they put in the a little Jameson in the, yeah. uh, in the old formula. You better do that with your son. Otherwise, <laughs> what kind of an Irish dad are you? <laughs> okay, guys. No. Drinking is injurious to your health. And it's delicious. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, but Rithic man, oh, you, dude. Jack, please release a longer video, please, because so, I would love to see like this was just cool to see your transformation from that to this. I would love to see how exactly you did it because you have to you have to have a strict eating regimen. You have to eat like all protein, the mental toughness <laughs> to forge and push. Uh, because the other thing too is you could do those things, but if you aren't doing them right, mm. you're not going to get the results. Yeah, you don't get the, that physique if you're doing it naturally. You have to push yourself past failure, past pain. Yeah. It, like he said, it was. And I'm it, sure it was absolute hell. And I'm sure, obviously, he has a massive team behind him of nutritionalists, of yeah. trainers, of yeah. And that's the other thing. Like I remember, my you know when when Stallone transformed his body after Rocky Two into Rocky Three in the Rambo days, uh, everybody was like, "What the freak did you just do?" And that's the problem with a lot of uh, aspirations for movie stars with great bodies is that you want to look like them. And the fact of the matter is, like, you don't have the time that they could. I, I guarantee he was probably putting in six hours a day. Oh yeah, at least. At least six hours a day just in exercising alone. And then the rest of the time was spent spending a whole lot of money on his supplementation and his vitamins and his hydration and his medical team and the food he was eating, eating the highest quality of everything with a chef cooking it for him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why he looked the way he did. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you gotta have money and you gotta have a team and time. Yeah, so, exactly. For so, us, for everybody else who has day jobs and this, you know, can barely go for a one mile walk at the end of the day. Yeah, you're not gonna look like Rithic. Yeah, don't beat yourself up. <laughs> Spoiler: yeah. you're not gonna look like Rithic. <laughs>